Hi. So here we have one more expression which we need to factorize. Expression is x to the power 4 minus 2x square minus y square minus z square plus 2yz plus 1. So this expression has 6 terms and 3 variables. So I think it's going to be a little tricky. So let's first note down the expression then we'll see how to solve it. So the expression is x to the power 4 minus 2x square minus y square minus z square plus 2yz plus 1. Right? So if we see this properly, this term has yz. So I think this term with y square, z square and this 2yz they are related. Right? So let's write them together and this 1 I think is related to this. So let us rewrite this expression. So this expression can be written as x to the power 4 minus 2x square plus 1 and if I take minus common from these three terms this can be written as y to the power 2 and this 2yz I am writing here so it will become negative because I have taken a minus sign common. So plus 2yz will be written as minus 2yz and this minus z square will be written as z square. Right? Yes. Now what is this? This is in the form of a minus b whole square. What is a minus b whole square? It is a square minus 2ab plus b square. Right? So this bracket can be written as y minus z whole square. Right? And now if we see these three terms properly, this is also in the format of a minus b whole square where a is x square and b is equal to 1. Right? Yes. So this can be written as x square minus 1 whole square. Isn't it? Yes, now this becomes in the form of a square minus b square. What is a square minus b square? It is a minus b multiplied by a plus b. And in this case, a is equal to x square minus 1 and b is equal to y minus z. Isn't it? Yes. So let's use this formula and rewrite this expression. So this will become x square minus 1 minus y minus z and the second term will be x square minus 1 plus y minus z. Right? And now let's open all the brackets. So this first bracket will become x square minus 1 minus y plus z and the second bracket can be written as x square minus 1 plus y minus z. Right? This has plus sign in front of the bracket. So signs inside the bracket will not be changed. And here we had minus sign. So if we open the bracket, all the signs inside the bracket will get changed. Right? And now we have to write it in alphabetical order. So this can be written as x square, then we will write this minus y, then plus z and then this minus 1. Right? And this will be written as x square plus y minus z minus 1. Right? So these are the two factors of this given expression. 